एक्सरसाइज नंबर वन ग्रोमेट आर वेंटिलेशन ट्यूब इंसर्शन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शुड आइडेंटिफाई द लैंडमार्क्स द टिम्पैनिक मेम्ब्रेन कैन बी डिवाइडेड इनटू फोर क्वाड्रेंट्स दे आर अंटेरो इनफीरियर पोस्टेरो इनफीरियर अंटेरो सुपीरियर एंड पोस्टेरो सुपीरियर द ग्रोमेट आर वेंटिलेशन ट्यूब इज कॉमनली इंसर्टेड इन अंटेरो इनफीरियर क्वाड्रेंट a radial incision is made using a meringotomy knife at anterior inferior quadrant the incision should not be very close to the annulus because if it is very near to the annulus the grommet tube or ventilation tube will be extruded very fast any fluid in the mid layer is sucked out carefully next a grommet tube is inserted in this exercise insertion of a shaws grommet tube is being demonstrated a grommet tube is dropped over the tympanic membrane using a crocodile forceps next the side flange of the shaws grommet tube is inserted through the incision first the remaining part of the grommet is gently pushed using a smooth curved hook this completes insertion of the grommet exercise once annulus is reached the annulus is elevated carefully using the same rosen's knife particularly at posterior inferior quadrant to avoid injury to cauda tympani and incudostapodial joint the elevation of annulus is best done under high power lens
Once tympanometal flap is elevated, the third step in stepatotomy surgery is removing posterior bony overhang and providing a good exposure to incudostapedial joint as well as stapes foot plate and stapedial tendon.